Keith Ranieri, former leader of that Clifton Park based Nexium cult, continues to fight his conviction from prison as he and his new lawyer seeking a new trial here. Ranieri convicted in 2020 on multiple charges connected to his time as leader of Nexium, where he sexually assaulted and blackmailed multiple women. An appeals court upheld his 120 year conviction just last month. In a court appearance yesterday, Ranieri's attorney, Joseph Tully, asking the judge to disqualify the motion for a new trial. Before disqualifying the motion for a new trial is dealt with due to alleged bias, Tully also asking for that new trial, alleging the FBI tampered with evidence leading to his client's conviction. Federal prosecutors have denied Ranieri's claims of government tampering with the evidence. Whether he's a, a good guy or a bad guy, a nice person or the, a, 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 the devil, um, it, everybody deserves a fair trial. Um, it'll be a, a completely different set of issues. Um, the new trial will be focused solely on the tampering, where the, the appeal uh, was not. Ranieri is not the only Nexium player here who has been fighting from prison. Last month, the court also upheld the sentence handed down to Claire Bronkman, former director of the group.